Hello, this is a very basic tutorial showing you how to use WX widgets in Visual Studio 2022. Okay, so the first thing go go to this page, you will find the link in the descriptions below and download zip file. Okay, so I have already downloaded this file, so I must download it again. So so that's the file you download. Okay. Uh, open. Go to build. So that's build here. MSW. Scroll down. So those are the Visual Studio Studio files. Okay. So the newer one is WX Visual Studio uh, 17. That's the newer one. So I must use it. Double click to open it. My computer is too lazy because because that sometime I pause the video to make this video shorter. So now it's, now it's opened. Those are the files. Uh, go to build. Batch build. So what you want to do, you want to select everything just by clicking select all okay and now press build and when you press build when you build it takes time that's depending of uh, in uh, your computer capacity for example for me it takes 30 minutes so click build build started so I will pause the video until the build are uh, completed okay uh, so it's uh, it's finished now uh, so now we can close visual studio uh, so now what we wanna do so that's our folder uh, let's put it in in some place for example in disk D okay let's pause so this is when I copy here it's here it takes time also so let's just we we take it here we let it here and let's just rename this folder by WX okay uh, so let's start Visual Studio to create WX widget uh, project okay let's pause so clear let's create a new project empty project and next so let's put it in desktop so let's put it here in this folder as you want uh, create So the empty project created. Let's create a new file. A new item. So 
C++ 5. <clears throat> so let's copy this simple this simple code of WX. Uh, WX widget so now here there is so here we include uh, WX and here we can't include it so what we want to do uh, just go to properties so so I assume that you want to create a uh, 32-bit application. Uh, go to properties. Go to C. Uh, general. Uh, additional include directories. Uh, let's add. So what we add? Excuse me. What we must add? So go to your folder of WX widgets. Go to include and add this. Uh, this thing here and also go to this here to this folder and add here add this also just separate by separate by semicolon okay and apply okay So here we must save. What is the problem here? <clears throat> there is something wrong here. Let me check. Let's check this. Let's see where is the problem. Yes, there is no problem. It just takes time. Okay. Uh, can we use like this or like this? Okay. That's the same thing. Uh, so let's try to compile. Uh, of course here you ca you must include this also you must include this like this link and this link also okay uh, just separate them by semicolon and apply okay uh, so let's now try to uh, Compile, okay. Let's wait. So that's the message cannot open the file that's a library we can't open this library 
So what we do to solve this problem, go ahead to the properties, all configuration, all platforms, go here and where we must go library directories here and here what you want to do open to the root of this folder and go to lib and add this okay so and copy this link and go to directories library directories and here and paste it here okay apply okay compile So I resolved uh, external symbol main. That's because we must say that this is a window application. Okay. That's a graphical user interface application. This application has a GUI. Okay. So what we want to do, go to linker, and uh, system. Here it says that that is a console application. Okay, so what you wanna do? Go to and say that's a window. Okay, a window application. We have a window in this application. Okay, and compile. Now we must see the window. So it succeed. So that's your window here. Okay that succeed so that's it for this tutorial I just want to show you how to download and install and use WX widgets in Visual Studio 2022 okay in next videos we will see we will explain this code and do other stuff okay uh, so that's it thank you for watching